Oh, I have something to give you. Oh, what is it? It's the money you paid for my college fees, take it. No, Barry. I will not take this money. Don't you know I love you? I would give you more if you need it. How can I take money from you? Please Eliza, take it. My mother asked me to give it to you. She insisted. No Barry. It's yours. I care about you. Give this money to your mom and tell her that Eliza didn't take it. But Eliza, it's important to my mom that we repay you. She feels responsible. And I appreciate that Barry. But I helped you because I love you, not because I wanted the money back. I understand, but please, just take it. It would mean a lot to my mom. She worked hard to gather this money. I understand your mom's feelings, but you should use this money for something you need. You and your mom have more use for it than I do. Eliza, you have been so generous already. Let me do this one thing to show my gratitude. It would make me feel better. Barry, your gratitude means a lot to me, but your well-being means even more. Keep the money. Eliza, you are making this difficult. Can't you just take it for my sake? No, I want you to have it. If you want to show your gratitude, focus on your studies. And make your mom proud. Okay, I see that you're not going to take it. I will let my mom know. Thank you for understanding Barry. And thank you for thinking of me. You're welcome, I just wanted to do the right thing. You always do the right thing Barry. That's why I love you. I love you too Eliza. And I'm grateful for everything you have done. Just promise me one thing. Always share your worries with me. We will face everything together. I promise, we are in this together, no matter what. That's all I need to hear. Now, let's enjoy our time together without any worries. Oh my God, I'm pregnant. I can't believe it. This is such amazing news. Jason is going to be over the moon when he hears about this. I can't wait to see the look on his face when I tell him. This is going to bring us even closer. I know my mom doesn't like him, but maybe this baby will change her mind. Lily, are you pregnant? Mom, what are you doing here? Are you spying on me? Just answer me. Are you really pregnant? Yes, I'm pregnant. How could you do that? Don't you have any shame? So what? This is my child. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with me? You haven't married yet, and now you are pregnant. Do you know the consequences when Harry hears about this? He will kill you. Mom, I love Jason, and I don't care about Harry. He is not my real brother. Don't forget that we are living in his house. He can kick us out. Okay, you go to the hospital and have an abortion. What? I will never do that. This is my child, and Jason will marry me. Lily, why don't you understand? He can't even support himself, let alone a family. Jason loves me, and we will find a way. He will support us. You are so naive. Love isn't enough to raise a child. You need stability, security, a proper home. You are throwing your life away for a boy who can't even provide for you. Do you know how hard it is to raise a child on your own? I'm not alone. I have Jason. We will make a family together. Lily, I just want what's best for you. I don't want you to suffer. I know mom. But I love him and this is my decision. 
I'm going to keep this baby. Fine. But you need to tell Harry. He deserves to know. I will, but I need to do it on my own terms. Just give me some time. Eliza, why are we here? And why did you book such an expensive room? We can have fun and relax here a little bit. Then we will go home. But we could have had fun at the park. You don't need to spend your money like this. Don't worry about the money. Tell me, did you like this hotel? Yes, I did. It's very beautiful. Why are you looking at me like this? Barry, kiss me. What? Kiss me. What happened? Why are you so nervous? Maybe we are doing this too early. Let's not hurry. What's wrong? We are in love. We should spend some quality time together. I know. But I just want to make sure we're ready for everything that comes with this. I understand. But sometimes, we need to live in the moment and enjoy our time together. I want to Eliza. I really do. But I also want to respect our relationship and take things slow. I appreciate that Barry. Your respect for us means a lot to me. But trust me, everything will be fine. I love you. Let's just enjoy our time here, no pressure, okay? Okay, no pressure. Just us. Honey, I have big news. You will be over the moon when you hear it. What's the news? You seem very happy. Harry likes Eliza. He has fallen in love with her and he wants to marry her. Oh really? That's wonderful news. Yes, we were talking in the office. He couldn't stop talking about Eliza. He wants to take her on a date. That's good. But what if Eliza doesn't want to go with him? She will go. I'm sure she likes him too. But where is she? Is she in her room? No, she hasn't come home from college yet. But it's getting late. She should have been home by now. Don't worry. Maybe she is with her friends. Still, it's unusual for her to be this late without letting us know. You're right. Let me try calling her. Good idea. I hope everything is okay. She is not picking up. That's odd. Did she mention any plans for after college today? No, she didn't. She just said she had an exam. I'm starting to get worried. Should we call her friends? Let's give it a little more time. Maybe she has caught up in something. We will wait a bit longer and see. Eliza, it's four o'clock. We should go home now. Let's stay a little bit more. I'm tired. No, your parents must be waiting for you. You should go home now. You are right. I have to go home. Anyway, thank you Barry, for spending quality time with me. I'm very happy today. Me too. It was wonderful being with you. I wish we could have more moments like this. 
It feels like time just flies when I'm with you. I know, but we need to be careful. Your parents will worry if you are not home soon. You are right. I don't want to get into trouble. We should plan another day like this soon. But maybe with better timing. Definitely. Next time, we will plan it better.